So Ramadan is actually not only specifically uh, practiced in the Islamic faith globally, it is something that was also practiced and even now is practiced by the Christian community as well as the, our counterparts, uh, you know, the, the Jewish community, the Judaism also observes like, you know, fasting seasons as well. Uh, so in, in Quran, in the holy book, uh, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, our, our Lord Almighty says that, uh, you know, Ramadan was prescribed to people before us as well, just so we can attain the, uh, you know, uh, control over our, uh, you know, desires and temptations. So this this year we were actually in a discussion with our interfaith group of uh, suburban areas between Hillier and Dublin called the SAIL, Safe Alliances of Interfaith Leadership, and they wanted to observe something about you know, progressive prayer services in the month of Ramadan and experience uh, what the Muslim community uh, is doing, I mean, how do, how do they observe Ramadan and what are the different essences of Ramadan. So we ended up opening it uh, to all, all of Columbus and uh, we were hoping that, uh, or we were actually thinking at one point that you know, it's a short notice call and many people might not be able to come. But uh, by the grace of God, we were able to get about 300 RSVPs. And uh, unfortunately, we actually have to stop at that point because of our you know, limitation of the space around here. Uh, but it definitely seems like you know, uh, there's a lot of need for people to understand and learn more about Islam and also uh, in general, like you know, learn about other, other faith diversities that exist in Columbus area.